Okay, so, hello everybody, my name is Lofter, and welcome back to what likely will be maybe the finale of The Messenger. Um, I have things to do. I'm working on something, and in order to do it, I need to finish this game. Uh, so look forward to that video hopefully soon, but I think I have solved The Messenger and Sea of Stars in terms of their plots. It's just a matter of I need to finish uh, this game and see if there's anything else that helps me substantiate my theory. So yeah, let's do this. Um, first thing I need to do is I need to go... So I consulted with Alex about what happened with the monk. And even though she says she's going to go talk to uh, the prophet, she actually goes... To where Wilfred, Win Win Winfred, whatever, the dragon. She, she's at the dragon. So that is my first objective: is to get to the dragon, which shouldn't take too terrible. Which shouldn't take too terribly long. Um, and we'll go from there. But I really need to see how this game unfolds in terms of its plot. So that I can make my little theory theory. Because man, I have been like, I've been pumping the brain juices on this all day. Like, I've, I, I know, I know I'm on to something. I understand how time travel works in these games now. I understand everything. I just need to make sure there's nothing that's going to happen that either full disproves me. Or even better, um... Maybe it'll prove me right. Maybe it's like, shoot, I really need to focus. Okay, this isn't bad. But yeah, I've just, I've got this in my head and I need to create it. I want to create it, but in order to create it, I have to finish this. Or it's either I finish this or I spoil the entire thing for myself. And that would be unfortunate. I don't want to do that. Oh, yeah, this is where we fought the general. I'm actually surprised he was following us around like that. How much farther? Okay, not that farther. But yeah, I'm really excited about this because, again, like I said, I've got the, I think I've got this whole thing figured out. I can't wait to make video uh, did I pass the checkpoint that I passed a dozen times previously I might have I don't know it'll be fine though all I gotta do is get to the dragon oh yeah that's the checkpoint that I was just talking about that I passed a dozen times previously then didn't touch but it's fine, because I don't have to go nearly as far as I, in fact, we're here. Wait, I'm here. Wait, 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 I'm here. Why isn't this working? Oh, no. Okay, well, that's fine. I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna have to, uh... Crap, 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 crap. What did I miss? She should be here. Maybe she's further down? Because I was told the monk was going to be there. Yes, I have a prophecy. What is my prophecy? 
where the heat melt stone and adventures alike a magic note awaits one skilled enough to traverse chaos incarnate i mean it just wants me to go down to hell right huh Um, let's see here. To die here actually I can avoid it but where I'm going is literally right here okay hang on we gotta head back okay so what should I do next he's not telling me more than one to get there in the past somehow? Damn it. That makes sense. How do I get to... Oh, just right there, huh?
Okay. That's what that's there for. Okay, so it occurred to me that uh, the monk can't time travel because I'm the, I'm the one with the scroll. So I went back in time. Well, I, I had to find a way to go back in time, which obviously wasn't that difficult. There she is. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. So did you talk to the prophet? Yes, it seems you have a real shot at breaking the curse on our world. So you used to be a messenger too? Indeed, my power is to travel to the past, where, as you, it seems, you can travel to the future. And if the prophet is right, you'll be needing this to save a friend. Farewell, ninja. We're all counting on you. There we go. That's what we wanted to see. Alright. So now we just need to go back to... And save Manfred. And then something spicy happens? Uh oh. Oh, Manfred, are you okay? Yeah, there's my boy. Manfred. That's it. Feels great to be able to move again. I bet. Yeah, freedom is where it's at. All right, we have the environment to save. Are you ready to go to the Elemental Skylands? Yes. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> nice. So we are going to the Elemental Skylands. I've been around. Enter all areas of the world. So, I'm not going to lie to you, buddy. This is bad. What's going on? It seems like the DB King managed to corrupt the Clockwork Concierge. Clockwork Concierge? A big robot that tends to this place. He's a butler superstar. I can't wait to meet him. Anyways, I was going to handle this myself, but Skylands made the robot in it. <laughs> Where do I come in? I'll drop you on each of the Skylands so you can disable the shield generators. Together, we'll see how big a punch the Clockwork Concierge packs. All right, enemies ahead. You're playing a different game now. Ah, I can charge. Bang! The Clockwork Concierge. Okay, so something else that was brought to my attention was um, the way the little short, uh, uh, mess, the, the little short, what you call it, talks, which makes perfect sense. It's the um, it's the the kids from Sea of Stars. Okay, so there are what you call it here. The last ones that I need, in fact. So yeah, we're gonna burn. Well, we're not gonna burn through. We're really gonna, you know, put our best, put our best foot forward. We're not here for a long time. We're here for a, an in informative time. I'm not looking to rush things, but I am looking to get it done. So we need to go up for that point, which we can't seem to get. Yeah, we can't get up for now. So that comes in a minute, I suppose. This area feels very frantic. Uh, okay, hopefully I can go back to that later. Alright, there's the shield generator. Bang. Nice. 
So I'm guessing now I just need to get to a point where Manfred can uh, pick me up again, yeah? All right, well, that's fine. Oh, where the, oh God, I didn't even, I heard the birds, but I didn't see them. Uh, okay. So my destination is that. Because, yeah, my primary, well, not my primary, but my big goal here is, uh, I really want, oh, it's up more. Jeez. This one seems like it goes the highest. All right. Ooh. Ah, so close. Yeah, this is just enemy hopping. That was not the correct way to do that. All right. Round three. Got it. Because, yeah, I'm, I'm missing three coins. So. Uh, and that's one. I don't even know what the coins get me, but, like, I'm this far, right? Like, why not just go for them? And the game's really fun. There's also DLC, and I do not know what that's going to be. Manfred's gonna pick me up here? Nope. Uh, just go down. Alright. Ah, nice. Feels really good to kill that many enemies in one shot. It's also crazy that, like I said, like, they did this in Sea of Stars too, though, where, like, at the very end of the game, they changed the genre of the game for a minute. Oh, cannons! I'm also liking how we're sucking in the time shards or whatever, yeah. Pretty good. Oh, I never did go back to the money sink either. Alright. Yeah, this whole area is just like frantic. I'm actually not doing so hot, am I? Alright, the Sky Earth Skyland is here. I'll catch you after you've disabled the shield generator. Good luck. Okay. Oh, wow, we have to go to the path. Oh, those are spikes. Those are not what I thought they were. Really hoping that would be help. Uh, but I need to go down, maybe. Yeah, there's a lot of places I need to go, but it's gonna require me to go through that portal first. All right. So now we go down here, and then we can go down here, which oh. Jeez, that was close. Yeah. I didn't realize I, I like for there was a moment where I didn't realize I couldn't step on those pots. I guess I need to go right here. Yeah, I feel like anxious here. Damn it. Oh, I have to be... Ah, I see. I can go to the past there. Or the future. Whatever. Whoa! No, wait. Hang on. Yeah, it definitely feels like we are on the... Okay, yeah. The final legs of our journey. Now we drop down here. Go this way. God, all the time travel stuff is happening. I mean, down doesn't lead anywhere. But what happens if I go to the past here? Ow.
There was a right. Uh, let's see. Oh, if, if you fall down, you're just kind of screwed? Oh, wow, yeah. You have to do everything again. Didn't see that coming. What? Oh, God, I know. Oh, wow. Yeah, I understand the mistake that I made now. So yeah, you gotta go around. Damn. Alright. Cool, 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 cool. There's the generator. So all I have to do now is, all I have to do here is like not fall through. I, I way overread the portal situation there. All right, nothing there. And nice little save point, beautiful. Uh, okay, so nothing actually over there looks like. I also don't see a coin in this area. Delightful. And we're done. And let's go, Manfred. Oh, he's so mad. Look at all the fire. Bang. Oh, that took a hit there. Okay. So now we're adding Buzz Sauce to the mix. All right. I managed to fly into... Damn, that hit me. Not good, not good, not good, not good, not good. I took too much damage. Three hit points left. Ooh, don't want to catch that bullet. Aw, oh, crap. That's not great. Alright, Water Skyland next. I'll catch you after you disable the shield. Nice healing. Good old door. I knew that. Uh, I don't actually know what the game wants me to do here, though. So there's a... Looks like, oh, well, I've got to go this way first, is what I've got to do. Okay. How the hell? How the hell? How would you ever be able to do that? Honestly. Oh. Okay, that actually wasn't that bad. It did require a tiny bit of focus, but I did it. This song is doing, it's not beating um, the forest, but it is very good. Okay. So now you want me to come back up here and do what game? Oh, go through the little hole. I see. Ow. Ow. I would like a help, please. I would I would like one help if you would mind. No, no one help, please. Thank you. They're really doing a good job of using the time shards to lead me this time. Ah, 
huh. Okay, so what's up? I don't know what's up. Not the Jenner. Well, now I need to know what's in the other direction. It's probably just crystals, right? Is it just time shards? Oh, jeez. Alright, well, I might as well go find out. It is just health and time charge. It's fine though. And then I probably just need to go around again. Cool. All right, and we're back. Not well guarded. That's three. How much? How There's that was all there is, right? There was only three. Bang! Bang! So we've done the that we've done wind, or no? We've done earth. Fire's next. We have to do the fire, the fire, whatever next. The fire island. Right? Right. Damn, look at the time shards. Come on, line up for me. This is fun. <laughs> Honestly, like, this is a nice little change of pace, you know? And like I said, fun, fun the time charge, which is kind of fun in of itself. I mean, everybody likes collecting stuff, especially when there's such a big money sink. All right, let's do this. Last one, probably. I mean, I presumably there's four elements. That makes the most sense, but who knows? Okay, the floor's not falling, so that's good. Ow. There is a coin here. Okay, I gotta come back in another direction. I see. I do kind of feel like this is a victory lap. Like, am I crazy? Like, I feel like I really know what I'm doing here. I missed it that way. Damn. Hang on. I mean, I gotta go back. Oh, how did I miss that? Ooh. Oh, I see what you want. Well, that wasn't correct. Alright. Come on, game. Give me some health. Jeez. Ow. I said give health, not take it! Please. Nope, no health. Alright. Alright, hang on. Oh, was there another one that hadn't fired a fireball? I think that's what happened there. This is the victory lap. Immediately dies like 400 times. Okay, good. I'm at full health. Ah, well, not anymore. The music. Okay, the music right there sounded not correct. Ride. 
why don't I just... Well, no, I kind of have to be floaty. I'm very likely editing parts of this episode. Obviously, I'm not doing it right now, but I have a feeling that if I want to make this a reasonable episode and still finish the uh, game like I planned, I'm going to have to cut it down. Oh, I also already have to edit it because I had to take a moment to... There we go. Yeah, it wasn't that bad. That's the final coin, isn't it? I can go open the chest. Hopefully. Yep, there it is. Destroy all power seals. I want to go back. I mean, it's kind of one of those things I've earned, right? Like, I want to know what it is. I want to know what my reward for this is. I've earned it. As much as I want to finish this game, I'm also deathly curious about what the hell is in this box. I've been fighting for it the whole game. It's ready. Look at it. The windmill shuriken. Avoid catching it to maximize. Oh, it's. <gasps> no. Cool. So I got a new weapon. Avoid catching it to maximize duration. Oh, and when it hits stuff, it still gives me um, a jump. Dope. That was worth it. That's a nice little, nice little toy. I think I feel like uh, that. I really like that shrieking a lot when I play Ninja Gaiden as well because I like jumping over it. It's always really fun. Ow. This is crazy. Still just really, really, really hoping for a health power up at this point. I mean, I'll get a save point at least right here, so that's good. I actually should have probably anticipated, uh... Alright, that should be the last shield generator, right? Yeah, this is feeling real big and empty as if I'm about to come up on a boss. Okay, I see the clockwork concierge. Let's do this, I'm assuming is what he said. Oh, he's awesome. Oh. It's like that, is it? All right, so what am I aiming for now? Why is it getting so much crazier? Like, as you kill the weapon, it's supposed to... Never mind, we're done. Look, that wasn't fair! I didn't know that's what was happening! Man! Oh, I was doing so good! I killed it in one try, and then the thing just kind of was like, okay, go. I was like, go where? <laughs> this music's fun. Oh, took a hit. got a strategy. Alright, now I know what to do. Oh! That's not the entire fight. There's more.
So what, I have to do this three times basically, I'm sure? On one life? Shotgun. Okay, I know what to do. All right, one more phase, probably. Ah, it might be too hard to say. Yeah, this is a lot until you take out these cannons. Oh, I've only got three hits left. Alright, gotta go again. Hopefully this is it. Good. Goodbye, clockwork concierge. Huh? Hey, welcome back. Who are you people and where's my hose? Nice to meet you, clockwork concierge. I'm a huge fan. I've stopped doing the voice because it hurt my throat. <laughs> this is unacceptable. I need to get back to my Skyland presently. Come on, chill. We just snapped you out of a demon spell. Is that so? Then it would be rude of me to let such a deed go unrewarded. Well, I'll agree to that. As I spent countless centuries in perfect harmony while catering to the intricate balance of the Skylands, my core materialized a very unique piece. Acknowledging how deeply your cooperation has touched my metaphorical heart, I would like to offer it to you. Oh. Well, there we go. It's the note of ser servitude. The note of helping. The note of butlery. The note of loyalty? The key of symbiosis. That was just... All right. Nurtured in the clockwork concierge's core across centuries of perfect harmony with the elements, it is one of the notes needed, blah, blah, blah. Whoa. Thanks, clockwork concierge. <laughs> now I have much to do. Is there anything else I can help you with? Well, yes. It's just... What is it? He always wanted to be a butler. You're his hero. Hey, not cool. Is that so? And what is your name, brave Scott Serpent? Manfred? Manfred, huh? Yes, I believe that will do. Really? Yes, you have the perfect name for an apprentice. No way, this is awesome. Now I should get back to my task. Come back to me when your quest is over. That's it! I'll be back, and I promise to work super hard. Yes, I believe we will first address your vocabulary. Very well for now, Manfred. And good luck, messenger. Sweet! All right. And then there will... There's only one more thing for me to do now, isn't there? Well, that happened. Manfred and the messenger saved the world. Can you believe it? Yeah, that was quite an adventure. When all this is over, that event alone is totally worth the second playthrough if you ask me. Anyways, I should get back to flying. Take care, buddy. All right, so where's the closest teleporting boost? This way. Wait, actually, uh, I need more notes. Cause we know the last note, but I think I'm better off teleporting there, right? Yeah, so we will go here, teleport to the Searing Craigs, or we could also... We could do this real quick. I am curious. Let's stare back. So this is the broken future. There's nothing here except for to go. I don't really think I need to do much besides go, right? Am, am I destroying those? Oh, it released a fairy. Yeah, because I don't think there's anything here for me to collect. I've gotten all the coins of power, so... 
little cheeky hole right there. I saw that. Alright, so where are you headed? Ah, up there. Interesting that the background for these are like stars. And I don't really know what the implications are for that. And it changed the music as if I was underwater. going. I really want to know what the implications of that being the space, being space back there is. Like, not even just space, but like stars, right? I don't actually know where... This area so far is pretty easy. But yeah, as I was trying to say before, I, uh, I kind of feel like this is a victory lap at this point. Like, I might die a few more times, but uh, not going to be a lot. Not going to be very much. So, I mean, I feel like I've got a master more or less a mastery of the controls. I don't know why I would go... Oh, hang on. There we go. Ooh. This is getting weirdly confusing. I mean, I'm not really entirely even sure where I'm going or why. But there's a there's a musical note here. Oh, I feel like we're at the end. We are definitely at the end. All right. So why is- Oh, it's raining people! Okay, so, just a little recap on some stuff. I bought, I bought the Demon King in the last episode, and it had four heads, and then it turned into the Dweller from Sea of Stars. My assumption was that that was the World Eater. I understand what all that stuff was now. So anyways, my assumption was that it was the World Eater from, uh... That was a shortcut, wasn't there? Yeah, I goofed. Anyways, my assumption was that, there was, that was the World Eater from the end of Sea of Stars, but it actually turns out that that's not the case. Um... Holy crap, I can't... There's a... There's... I gotta go. Oh my god. No, he got me. But uh, that that was the case. That the thing that I saw the 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 thing that we saw at the end of Sea of Stars must have been a different world eater. That's the only thing that really makes sense here. So Oh god, it's so close. Oh my god, it's too close! I can't go any faster! Oh wow. This is awful. I wish I could take time to, like, look at this thing. But I cannot. Uh-oh, that was it, wasn't it? Jeez! I was not expect- well, bye. <laughs> I missed the- you've got to hit that hook or you just lose. Oh 
Oh, I can grab the fairies with the hook. That's helpful. Well, I'm boned. I'm not boned yet. Uh. Jesus. Oh my god, it's so much. Oh! Oh no. I think we're fine. I think we're fine. I think we make it. I think we make it. I think we make it. I don't think it can catch me at this point. It might can. It probably can. I'm running. We can never go back. Whoa, you made it back. Never again. This is incredible. What did you find? An abomination I couldn't describe with words. Sick. Anything else? I found one of the music notes. Yes, I knew it. Do you know what this means? I guess we're one step closer to lifting the curse. That and the shopkeeper has to do the dishes for a whole week. I won my bet. Thanks. Okay. Well, let's fix the time sink. Wow. Well, that was underwhelming. Yeah, I've seen my fair share of cheaply implemented optional item use payoff, but this one takes the cake. I know, the wrench didn't even appear in my inventory. Irredeemable. So, what was the point of unclogging the sink? To waste more time shards, of course. No, you need to say hi for me. Haha, <laughs> why hello there! Who are you? I thought there were only three blue rooms left. My, is it really down to just three? Sounds like hiding in here was a good call. Anyways, welcome, adventure, to the Craftsman's Corner. I am Ironhood, entrepreneur and extraordinaire. Haha! -ha. Ironhood, I think I've heard of you. Well, you certainly heard of my creations. I see you are fully equipped with them this very moment. Haha! -ha. Really? Haha! -ha. You didn't think the shopkeeper was the one who made the climbing claws, now, did you? Which, by the way, how are they working out for you? Well, sometimes they make me clean to the wall when I would rather keep falling. <laughs> but other than that, I guess they're fine. I see. Maybe using spider hair wasn't such a good idea after all. Ha ha! Pardon? Ha ha! But it matters not. I have since charged, changed my vocation to toy making. Toy making? Toy making! Ha ha! So you sell toys! Ha ha! I'll stop the awkward laugh now. Here, take a look. Oh, but what do they do? Okay, cool. Um, yeah, we'll definitely do that someday. Anyways, that might be something I just do in my free time. <laughs> um, so I guess now we have to go to hell. Cause, wait, we're down to one. Yeah, we're down to one music note. I don't know what happens when we find the last one, but we're nearly there. Yeah, so all I gotta do now is get down to hell and see what I can find. We're so close. Oh yeah. I almost didn't make it to my finger to the trigger in time. It's not really something you can see, but uh, yeah, that was pretty sketch. Eh. Eh. This is a good song. This is probably the number three song. Maybe number two. All right. This isn't how we got here previously, though. We were. Oh yeah, that's right. We were sort of dumped in here. I mean, I don't know how to do what we need to do, but I gotta figure it out. Yeah, I honestly really truly do not know how to get to the place I need to get to. Like, I see it on the map. I know exactly where I gotta go. 
but I do not know how to get there. Oh, there's a down over there. Wait, where's this down at? Two screens to the right. That might be what I'm looking for. Brick. So I gotta go that way. Oh wow, all the way back here, huh? Oh wait, we're just right here. Yeah, so... It's down. Oh my god! I see it! I did not- Oh my- I've been here how many times? And I didn't see that before? Oh, I saw it at the last- Like, the last instant. There's a drop down right there. It's just so close to the bottom of the screen that I didn't notice it. I mean, it's mostly just running on lava, which is just regular running, for the most part. I almost feel like I can... Nah. Oh, I forgot! I stopped pressing left. Wow. Okay, this is actually gonna be... Can I take damage and still run through lava? I don't know. Or over lava, I should say. <sighs> All right. Oh, am I gonna make it? Barely. Yeah, so this part isn't bad. It's the next room that sucks. But we did it. As we always do eventually. I panicked. Oh, this is not runnable lava. This is just me having a scoop. Like, no mistakes. Oh, uh, now what? Hey! Last music note. Anyways, the little chubby guy's the artificer. This is it. What's gonna happen? We finally did the thing. We did all the things. At long last, the melody is complete. Okay, what's next? Heck if I know. What? My knowledge is limited to the prophecy, which ends with the gathering of all music notes. Well, someone here has to know. Indeed, brave messenger. It is time for the first of our order to share with you the origins of the curse. Be right back. This better be important. Behold, the melody is complete. Impossible. Can we finally be nearing the end? I completed the melody. Do you know what to do next? Well, I guess it's only fair. Okay, I officially forgive you for saying my shop didn't look like a shop. What? When we first met, I was really happy to show you the place, and then you said it didn't look like a shop. Have you been bitter all this time? I was just trying to do small talk. Sure, whatever. 
it's behind us now. Seeing as how much progress you made, it's about time I filled you in on what's really going on. Here we go. Eons ago, a civilization of giants lived in the clouds, protecting the world from unknown forces. Yes, indeed. They had at blocked access to the Sea of Stars, and we needed their permission to get there. Centuries went by in harmony until one day they watched helplessly as the world suffered a massive flood. So this is after... How did... How, by the way, though? How did that happen? Only a single piece of land remained. Ever adapted, humanity gathered its survivors and built a huge temple where they would find new meaning. Okay. That's probably our forlorn temple. Answering the call of these troubled times, a formidable couple stood up to be their leaders. Uh oh. Gifted with a beautiful voice, and an otherworldly ability to create mesmerized shrink mesmerizing trinkets. Everyone called her Muse. And he, ever stoic, fearless, and mysterious, would become known as Phantom. After a decade of relative stability, the skies began to flash red as if a war was being waged against the sky giant. Indeed, an army of demons, destroyers of worlds, have found the human realm. With humanity's protectors soon to be extinct, Muse and Phantom inspired everyone to prepare for the inevitable onslaught. The demon army was too strong, the temple was lost, and Muse was killed while trying to protect her people. Oh my god, is Shopkeeper Phantom? Fighting back tears, Phantom picked up her final creation to keep as a memento, a music box. Abandoning the temple to the Demon King, he led the last survivors of his race to the western edge of the island. That final stand proved successful, and after instructing his people to rebuild and stay hidden, Phantom pushed his luck. Blinded by rage, he darted toward the temple in a foolish attempt to take down the Demon King. Insulted by the boldness of this broken being, the Demon King opted for a punishment worse than death. So that's one, two, three, and four from Sea of Stars. As well as the uh, dweller that killed Garl. Corrupting his love's memento with demon magic, he turned Phantom's music box into a tether to the human realm. Every 500 years, they would come back to torture humanity until they abandoned all hope and surrendered to extinction. Phantom was forced to wear a curse mask which would steal his mind and keep him in a state of perpetual distress. Inserted into the music box, he would play the organ forever to keep his realist relics magic alive. In this both mental and physical prison, he would be the one to ensure the curse and his legacy was maintained. But Phantom's will was a strong one, offering lapses of sanity here where he could tap into his growing understanding of the demon magic. The fight to get rid of the curse would last centuries, so his people would need the ability to cooperate across generations.
Time travel was the key. With his last stretch of sanity, he wrote a scroll, imbuing it with enough power to attune its carrier to time magic. Okay, so Shopkeeper is not Phantom. Phantom is inside the music box. Before losing his mind completely, he teleported his final hope, the scroll, to his people's hideout. As they soon realized, the scroll let them see strange manifestations, things not every mind could stand. <laughs> Only a few brave adventurers had strong enough <coughs> will to carry the scroll. They called them messengers. Yo, that one's cool looking! That's Archer, or an Archer. With the ability to step through space-time tears, they had access to the Void, a safe haven outside of time. Messages from all time periods would soon gather there, the perfect meeting point for their endless war. But as it turned out, meeting denizens of the future, or even one's alternate self, could be troubling for some. After a few incidents of more primitive messages going into shock, they opted to conceal their appearance. Thus, the Order of the Blue Robes was founded, and together they built their headquarters, the Tower of Time. Every curse cycle would have its champion, who would join the order after passing the scroll to the next messenger. With the support of the blue robes, after many cycles, the music box was reclaimed from the forlorn temple. I would like to play that game. Like, I really wonder how they got that out of there. Even though the relic was too powerful to be destroyed, a new hope was found that day. Mysterious forces of the world started materializing in the form of magical music notes. After one particularly gifted messenger managed to gather two of them, an idea emerged. An idea crazy enough that it just might work. If they created a melody strong enough to breach the music box's protection spell, maybe a messenger could enter it and rescue Phantom. So there you have it! I'm not sure what you will find inside the music box, but if we have one shot at saving Phantom, this is it. Be on your guard, his mind will have conjured all sorts of traps. Good luck out there. Uh, the music box beckons! Are you ready to face your last challenge? Um, yeah! In we go! All right, this is it. Oh, look at this thing. I don't know why time traveling is required in the music box, that's weird. Trying to keep my wits about me. I gotta go that way now. Ah. Uh. Okay, I might need to try to be a little bit more patient with stuff. Dirty, dirty game.
All right, so I'm guessing that's ow her. I don't like the way these things move. They're very uncomfortable. At least I have the option of the ability to leave. Not that I would, mind you. Hang on. Wait. Okay. Uh, up. Actually, what? Oh, there's a bat. I was like, what the hell hit me? All right. Oh, okay. Man. Oh, there's bats. Oh, the damn bats. Well, that was just bad. Hopefully this is help. Yes, it is. Oh, wow. Yep. It's fine. Woo! I wonder how long this area is. I missed it by inches, mere inches. I should have started from the left, the, the, the third one. That's fine. <gasps> no, that's the opposite of what I wanted. I, I'm having trouble seeing these bats. And I don't know if it's because like, I'm like kind of a little bit in a hurry, or if it's because they're blending into the background a certain way. Alright, so this room is not super easy. Got it. Thank you for the save point. Appreciate that. How far does that thing go? Another save point? My birthday. Ah, oh, it was almost perfect and then it wasn't. Everything's like got a clockwork style momentum. Oh shoot. Gotta be a little bit more careful. Balls. That was not careful enough. Yeah, this clockwork style of like mo mobility everything's using is weird. Okay, now what?
Well. Well. Balls. That's gonna set me back, isn't it? Yeah. The worst part is, I know it was my fault. Oh! Nope. This way. Alright. Let's do this slowly. Ugh. Okay. Now I'm on the correct rhythm. Uh, woo! What am I looking at? Okay, I have a couple of options here. I guess we'll go this way first. Wait. Incorrect. Him caught setting up all kinds of traps, huh? Hang on, okay. Gotta do a circle. Huh. Interesting. Still no. Oh, I want that. Okay. Yeah, save point. Let's get it. Down? Down. Woo! Okay. trying to keep my head on here, but man, this is... There's things happening. Uh oh. It's like, it's all very uncomfortable. The way everything moves... It's just not comfy. Alright, where the hell do I go here? This is a long zone. At least there's plenty of save points. Okay. Hmm, that was not correct. I don't know why that happens sometimes. I'm going to imagine it's because the everything synced up to the music. Is my best guess. my shurikens as much as I should, but then again, I don't know how much is how much I should. Ooh. I should really work on my patience. Oh, yeah, 
gotta get up there, press the crystal. And, well, that is what it is. Okay. Oh, I see. Yo, if you do this correctly, it looks good. <laughs> I didn't really know what to do. Okay, now where? Uh, I'm gonna guess up first. way. Ow. No. Oh, is it didn't back around me? Crap. Oh, stop sticking to the wall. through here? There it is. Okay, good. And a save point because, uh... Stupid bat making me hesitate. a little quiet but there's not a lot of obviously not a lot of story happening and also um this is quite difficult as you might imagine with it being the final dungeon of the game ow balls Don't die, don't die, don't die. Okay. Gotta get to that. And I got a free hit point to beat. Alright. I guess only a little bit, but yeah. Oh. Oh. We've made a lot of progress. That's great. It's a lot of just like little skill challenges here, yeah? Oh, we're here. This is it. Something's it. Something's here. I guess we'll see what's going on. 
is it? Uh, I must be having visions again. Are you okay? I mean no harm. Intentions matter little. My tune must be played. It was fated. Who are you? Did you see my message? <coughs> How dare you trespass here? I'm here to help. You have been cursed. <gasps> cursed? It's all true then, isn't it? All of it. But you can end this now. Remove the mask. Preposterous. I shall make short sure work of you. I am not your enemy. You created the scroll, didn't you? <gasps> Impossible. How long has it been? Did someone really get my message? Enough! You'll pay for your treachery. Listen to me, Phantom. It took centuries, but humanity never gave up on you. Lies, lies, lies. I'm here to set you free. I shall have none of it. Prepare to die, intruder. All right. Well, we don't know what he's going to do. Okay. Oh. how I was expecting that to work. Okay, this isn't bad. You'd think this would be, like, really hard to see, but... I mean, I guess it's not. Oh, this lasers! Okay, what now? Okay. Oh, it's different now. Oh, it's different now. It is different now. sure what to do there. I guess I have to knock it away. Like, the way it feels. Alright, I can do this. I almost got it in one try. Huh. Do I have to hit him in a certain time period? Why is this different this time? I don't know why that was so different. Okay, so this time... So the electricity exists in the future, not the past. Okay. back here. I do not understand that sequence. Damn it. I've already taken a lot of damage. Oh, I can do that. Okay, noted. Yeah. <laughs> 
Wait. Okay. Got him. Okay, it's different this time. Oh, damn it. No! Okay, that is that bad. I don't know how to make this sequence end. Got him. All right, two tries. Could have done it in one, but I kind of screwed up at the end. So I have defeated Phantom. Oh, what a handsome boy. Thank you. I... The music box! No! All my memories! My love! This is bad! Let's get out of here! I really hope they make it out fine. I'd love to finally meet Phantom. I'm so worried right now. I'm so worried right now. What if the shopkeeper doesn't get there in time? I knew I should have gone myself. We made it. It's finally over. Oh, it's this looks like another boss. I mean, this is... Do you want to try the Tower of Time challenge I designed? Give us some time. He has had quite a ride. But I've been waiting for this moment ever since I was first given the scroll. Can't you just breathe just this once? What's wrong? The curse, the masked energy. I don't want to go back. I can't. All those walls. Hey, you're safe now. Don't worry. It's here. It wants to take me back. <laughs> oh, hey, it's the mask. Oh, this is bad. As I feared, Phantom was keeping the curse's power contained. How do we stop it? We don't. Its full force has finally been unleashed. We were fools. That was their plan all along, to let the curse grow in power as we waged an ultimately meaningless battle. Only to annihilate us completely when we thought we had won. What are you talking about? Surely you won't all give up so easily. Any suggestions then? I'm listening. It's simple. We have to do the thing. The order is down to three of us. You know we're no match for such a force. Everyone here has been attuned to the scroll, so we should be able to all do the thing. Everyone with me! Are we six? Yes! We're doing the thing! Oh, we're coming for you. Or I'm coming for it. Something's happening. Oh, Shin. Oh, proceed! I see it! Shinku! Hadouken! Whoa! Keep pressing A! Nobody told me to keep pressing A! The fake ending was better. <laughs> that was the name of the achievement I just got. Hell yeah! Oh, so good! They did the same thing with uh, Sea of Stars 2 where they left it with this just like this big like you probably can't fail this, but it's gonna feel good. Oh, so good! Isn't there DLC? Oh man. Oh man. That was wonderful. I love that. Thank you for playing! What you got for me? Give me something, game. I need more lore. <laughs> then the mask shattered into pieces and humanity was finally rid of the demon curse. <laughs> oh, this is not just a story. The end. Wow, talk about a long story. Well, you asked. Anything else I can help you with? I don't know. I can't afford any upgrades at the moment. Well, do you have any other stories to share? Of course, here's one for you. <laughs> Ooh, to be continued. Oh God, I love it. It wasn't quite as good as Sea of Stars, but man, what a game, what a game. All right, 
So I've beaten the game. I do have to get back to work on my little side project now where I'm, I'm writing a script for, for this game and Sea of Stars. But yeah, thanks everybody so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, why don't you give me a like and a follow and a subscribe and maybe watch some more videos because, man, I'm really putting in the time here. Not to mention, this is fun. God, that was fun. Ah, ah, okay. So what do we got? Three, four, five years until the next game comes out? <sighs> All right. Deuces, dummies. <laughs>